Good morning, students. Continuing with the explanation of the lesson, Bismillah Khan was totally dedicated towards it. He used to practice music on the banks of the Ganga for hours to achieve perfection. He was so inspired and motivated by the river Ganga that it helped him to improve his performance. and he also invented many ragas and different sounds that were considered impossible to be produced by a shehnai when bismillah khan was 14 years old he accompanied his uncle to the ahlabad music conference and his talent was appreciated by ustad fayyaz khan in 1938 he was selected for the all india radio lucknow where he had his program and impressed all his listeners he was also the first indian to greet the nation with his shehnai from the red fort on 15th august 1947 when india gained independence bismillah khan gave many memorable performances both in india and abroad the king of afghanistan king zahir shah really liked bismillah khan's performance and had gifted him the priceless persian carpets a film director vijay bhat was so impressed when he had heard him play the shehnai at a festival that he named a film after the instrument called gunj uthi shehnai